legacy of the 1953 coup in Iran is shaping politics to this day. We have an, a government in Iran and a political system in Iran that probably never would have emerged. American-Iranian relations might never have deteriorated this way. Think of it this way. Had we not overthrown Mossadegh in 1953 and had allowed democracy to grow, we might have had a flourishing democracy in the heart of the Muslim Middle East all these 60 years. And I can hardly wrap my mind around how different the Middle East might be if that were the example we had set. Instead, we set the opposite example. Here was the message we sent to the rising generation of leaders throughout the Middle East. The United States does not want democracy because democracy in a Middle East country is going to lead to demands for controlling resources. What we want is a dictatorial leader who can repress his people as much as he wants, and we will help him do that as long as he gives us free access to oil. That was the message of the Iran coup, and that was heard all over the Middle East, and it led to the emergence of all the kinds of regimes in the Middle East that have created the crises that we now live with. So this was a decisive, historic episode. When you read a history of the 20th century, in many cases, you'll be lucky to find one line on this coup. It should be a big chapter. Norman Derbyshire, take one. I wrote the whole thing up from beginning to end, and that is definitely on file. I think I could persuade them to let me see it. It's the sort of thing you won't find in any book. <laughs>